Though Minecraft's charm has, in part, always been found in its blocky, retro-styled graphics, a good portion of fans would like their experience to look as breathtaking as possible. As part of Minecraft for Windows 10, NVIDIA has partnered with Microsoft to implement ray tracing, improving light, shadows, and reflections throughout the game for the best looking version yet. If you're ready to see what Minecraft has in store for the next decade of gaming, you've come to the right guide. To get ray tracing up and running in Minecraft, you'll have to make sure that you've got both the compatible hardware and version of the game. As of right now, ray tracing only works in Minecraft for Windows 10, so if you're using the older Java version of the game originally released a decade ago, you'll need to pick up a new copy of the game for use with ray tracing. You'll also need to make sure you have a compatible graphics card. An NVIDIA RTX 20 series or 30 series is required for use here. GTX graphics cards from NVIDIA don't support ray tracing, so make sure your card is supported. If it's not, Minecraft will stop you from installing ray tracing themes. For more detailed specs, visit the link in the description below to view the full list of minimum requirements to run Minecraft with ray tracing. Finally, to finish getting ready, make sure your graphics card drivers are updated by using NVIDIA's update software on your computer and installing any pending updates. If this doesn't work, you can download the latest drivers and software for your card from the manufacturer's website if necessary. Now it's time to download some of NVIDIA's ray tracing enabled packs online from Minecraft. The easiest way to do it is to use the marketplace built into the game itself. From the main menu, just click on Marketplace, then search for NVIDIA. Feel free to download any ray tracing supported pack from NVIDIA or any of its partners, then hit the Create World button from the pack installation page. You can edit your settings here and add any additional packs from the resources settings. When you're finished, just hit Create. You can also download packs from NVIDIA's website. Click on the second link in the description below, then scroll to NVIDIA and Partner Resource Packs. You'll find the download links in this section highlighted. To install, just double click on the MC pack file while the game is running and each pack should install itself. To use it, just go to your settings menu. Under general, click on global resources, then on my packs. Click on the pack you've downloaded, then select activate to apply it to your session. If you like this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering Minecraft and other technology. And don't forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.